Avanti International is the leading supplier of chemical grouts for sewer rehabilitation, structural water control, and soil stabilization. Since 1978, Avanti's product line has grown from acrylamide gel and urethane to over 15 chemical grouts. Avanti provides the technical support necessary for applicators to achieve successful results in a safe and efficient manner. Avanti's strategy of supplying the highest quality chemical grouts focuses on the correct application of the products. Pump Operation Training A key factor is the proper use of the pumping equipment. In this presentation, you will learn the operating procedures for the Graco Ultra 395, Ultra 495, and the Ultra Max 795. The Graco Ultra 495 pump will be used in this training. All of the Ultra Series pumps operate in the same manner. The viscosity or thickness of the grout is the main factor in pump selection. The on and off switch is located in the back of the machine, and the pressure adjustment knob is on the top. The directional flow valve is at the bottom of the intake manifold. Step 1. Safety first. The personal protection equipment required while using chemical grouts is head protection, splash-resistant goggles, Tyvek chemical-resistant coveralls, and chemical-resistant gloves and boot covers. Step 2. Hose and resin gun attachment. To attach the hose to the pump, use an open-end wrench as a backup on the pump fitting while tightening the hose fitting to a snug fit. Next, attach the resin gun to the hose in the same manner and tighten to a snug fit, being careful not to over-tighten. Step 3. Flushing the system. Before and after using chemical grout, the pump must be flushed using AV208 acetone. Chemical grout is activated by water. Therefore, no moisture can be present in the pump or hose. Pour approximately one gallon of acetone into a clean five-gallon pail. The circulating tube is the smaller tube. The larger tube is the pickup tube that carries the product to the resin gun. Submerge both tubes into the acetone. Next, turn the power switch to on, making sure the directional flow valve arrow is pointing to the rear of the machine. This position circulates the material through the hose to the gun, building up pressure. Once pressurized, the pumping action stops. At this point, be extremely careful with the resin gun. It is loaded with product and will discharge when the trigger is pulled. Now, with the gun nozzle aiming back into the 5-gallon pail and the pressure knob at its lowest setting, pull the trigger and begin pumping product through the system. After running a half gallon of acetone through the system, lift the tubes out of the product and continue discharging product from the system until it clears. Then, turn off the pump. Step 4. Charging the pump with chemical grout. To prevent product contamination, pour approximately 2 gallons of chemical grout into a clean 5-gallon pail. Submerge both the circulation and pickup tubes and turn the pump on. Make sure the pressure setting is on its lowest setting and the directional valve is pointing to the rear. The pump is now filling the line with grout. At this point, everything is charged up to the discharge trigger. The gauge only indicates discharge pressure as product passes through the gun. Step 5. Cleaning the pump. To properly clean the grout from the pump, remove the tubes from the grout pail spraying the remaining product back into the pail until the lines are empty. Keep the nozzle low in the pail to prevent splash. Place the tubes into a new pail of acetone and flush the system as previously described in Step 3. Remember to always use low pressure for setting up and cleaning the pump to prevent splashing. Safety goggles must be worn throughout the process. The final step is to run a Vanti pump wash through the pump by pouring two gallons into a clean five-gallon pail. Submerge the tubes and turn the flow directional valve to point downward to circulate the product through the pump. Allow the pump wash to circulate for approximately two minutes. The pump wash lubricates and protects internal pump components, ensuring quality performance and longevity. Once complete, turn off the pump and place the tubes in the drain cup on the back of the pump to drip dry. Thank you for viewing the pump training video. If you have any further questions, please call Avanti Tech Support at 1-800-877-2570.
For training on the proper use of Avanti Grout, click on www.avantigrout.com.